when you pull up, you unload your car, and they see how easy it is, they'll all have envy. You know, I step out, push the button, the car rolls out. You can pull your car up on the slider, secure it, slide it back into the car hauler, and uh, feel safe that you know, it's not going to get scratched. I don't think you could buy a nicer trailer. I wouldn't take my car anywhere unless it was in a slider. It's just a great, great thing for someone like myself or anyone who has a valuable car that transports them. Here at Casey Slider, after many years, we've seen a need in the industry um, to change an inherited problem we had in being able to haul vehicles. So we engineered a new uh, means in the Casey Slider. The problem with putting a car in a trader is has been around since traders invented. I mean, since the square box was invented, putting a car in that thing is a, is a task for somebody. You have a tendency to scratch them as you're crawling out the window because that's the only way to get out because you can't uh, open the doors because it's not wide enough. Slide into a narrow space with something that's not supposed to be in a narrow space and uh, trying to crawl out the window or slide by the car, any number of things to damage the car because it'll happen, it's happened to me. I was loading a, a Shelby that I built uh, for a gentleman here, a uh, 67 Shelby GT500, and we was putting it in a conventional trader. And of course we had a lot of help trying to get it in the trader, so when you have a lot of help, they have a lot of direction, a direction of people telling you which way to go. Pretty soon the direction become wild and the car got off to the side and hit the side of the trader. Because you're trying to go in and you're trying to get it in there and people are trying to direct you, and so we had a very close incident to uh, damage the, the uh, 67 Shelby. In fact, we, we dinged the door on it is what we did to it. So we had to back it out of there and cry a few tears and start over. We've had customers before they even get the car home have already scratched the car after we spent months and months and hundreds of thousands of dollars to get the car into the, the way it needs to look, the pristine look. And I've got customers that can't even get them home without scratching them. So we recommend people use a KC slider to get their babies home. Use it so you don't have to come see me again. I've been a car lover for years and uh, you know I have some personal experience with damaging a high-end vehicle while transporting it. Uh, we own a uh, Boyd Cuttington built car. It's a fat fendered car, very wide car and it's, uh, it's, it's a car that we all love and everybody that's ever seen it loves it but we uh, through time found that we weren't taking it out. We weren't getting it out of the shop. We weren't showing it. We weren't uh, sharing it with the public because it took us approximately an hour to load it in the vehicle and approximately an hour to unload it. And now that we have the KC Slider product, we're able to take that out and uh, take it to small shows. People may or may not ever get to see uh, a car like that car. Now we get to share that with them and, and see the enjoyment and the fun that car enthusiasts have by getting to see vehicles like that. So. You know, uh, that's the answer. That, that's the thing for us is that we want to be able to see people take the vehicles they have their time and money and that they love and be able to take them out and share them not, and have the peace of mind that they're not going to damage it while loading, unloading, or even in some cases we show that vehicle on that deck. Uh, our product is of, of such high quality that, uh, you know, it matches the, the level of these cars and it's a it makes a great uh, deck to display or to show the vehicle. And that's the great thing about it. It was designed by someone who respects cars and knows uh, how valuable they are. The process of me thinking about taking a vehicle of the, and bringing it in and out of that trailer was very, very hard to do because it's a hard, it's a hard process. You think it's very easy, but it's not. So my thought to that thing is I've got to have a platform in that trailer somehow. And to get that thing out of there, we've got to have something to haul it out of there. We went through numerous ways to pull that thing in and out of there. I've had people from Boeing, engineers help me, from the site help me. I've had the, the college kids up here helping me. You know, their ideas was great, but man, it just was real clumsy. It looked like a, a brick coming out of there. It just looked like, it, you, man, you wouldn't want your car to be on that thing. It was all about look. I wanted it to look really good. The engineers from Boeing and LA, they didn't care what it looked like. They just wanted to go out and get outside. I says, guys, we've got to make this thing look good too. It's got to look, because that car comes out of that trailer, it's got to look good. The first presentation, the first time somebody sees it, is what matters. The slider basically, I mean, the whole floor is coming out. So it's just like a silver platter. Everything's rolled out evenly. It's sitting, you know, it's elevated above the ground. You're looking at it. You know, you can see under the car, all the way around it, and it's just literally sitting on a silver platter for people to check out all the way around. 
The sliders, just as nice as the cars that we build. I mean, they've spent the attention to detail, they've worked on everything to, to make the, the trailer as nice as the cars that we're building. You know, we've had many of our satisfied customers, after they receive the product, call us back and tell us that, uh, that it truly is a red carpet experience for their high-end vehicle to be able to be at a show and to slide their product out and actually start to display it as it's coming out of their trailer. I wanted the, the trailer to look like the, the car belonged in there, not just a square old box with a, a heater in it or something. You know, I wanted that slider to look like the car that we was calling. So we have the capability of uh, actually building the slider to look like your car, to have the personality of that uh, car. So your slider will be the personality of your car. So you have two things in one there. You've got your slider and you've got your car, and they both complement each other very well. We uh, utilize a ATC uh, Aluminum Trailer Company trailer. It's a very high-end trailer. It gives us the ability to customize, to offer many features uh, in the trailer itself. And once the trailer is designed to our high-end customers' needs uh, and customized to their likeness to fit their vehicle the way they want it, uh, then we can uh, also customize the KC slider uh, to, to fit that, uh, the requirements and the engineering specifications that they may have. When I placed my order for my KC slider, I mean, it was just like my car, right? They had written plans of what the trailer would look like, uh, what the options were. Basically, their car guys, I mean, they knew what, what I wanted. They, they, were, they didn't look at it like uh, it was just another trailer. I mean, it was just like building a car. You know, what specs do you want? How do you want it to look inside? You know, how's the finish going to be? You know, little details like cover the spare tire or just the, the smallest details. I mean, Casey Slider knew uh, what, why I wanted it, you know, and then how they were going to accomplish it. When we get a customer that wants one of our products, uh, we, we bring them in. They become a very valuable member of our team. Each and every step of the way from the design process, the engineering, you know, to picking the colors, and, and we keep them involved uh, all the way through that. Um, when you're talking a high end, um, product, we feel like that, that, that the, our customers should be a part of that team. So we involve them from the start to the finish, right up to when we deliver the product to them. We're very satisfied that we have that ability to interact with our customers like that. You know, when I ordered my Casey slider, I knew when the trailer arrived at their facility, I knew where they were at in the production as far as installing the slider, the accessories, they called me. It was just a complete, uh, just great. I've never had anybody, you know, to treat me like that, you know. I've, I knew where I was at the whole time with the KC slider, you know, until it showed up in my door. I felt like I was a part of the build, which is really what I'm after, you know. I want to build something, I just don't want to order it. One thing I like about the KC slider is the ease of use, and it's comfortable, it's secure, and it's anybody can use it. They can secure their car, slide it into the car hauler, and feel comfortable hauling it cross country or to the next town to a car show. You look at the KC slider on the website, and it looks simple. It really is. My wife can load these cars on this trailer. Once we get the, the wheel chalk set up once for the car, you just drive the car on, strap it on, she can do it in a dress if she has to. But it is simple, and the touch of a button, and the car's loaded into the trailer, shut the doors, and you're off to the show. You don't have to worry about damaging your car. And when you get there, you could even show your car on the trailer if you want to. Just push the button, the deck slides out, there you are. Anybody that owns a high-end car loves to talk about their car. I don't care who it is, they, they want to show it to you, they want to get every aspect and they'll talk hours about it. So if they can roll it out of that trailer real fast, they're going to show it and they're going to have fun with it. You know the KC Slider product is revolutionary. It's uh, one of a kind. There's nothing else out there like it um, and it offers one of a kind and revolutionary opportunities. And uh, we love our product and we know you'll love our product as well.